Hello everyone, Sister Candice, growing in grace. I hope y'all are having a good week. I do want to thank you for praying for me. You know, when you're in so much pain, it weighs on you um, mentally, emotionally, and, and physically. But we know who holds tomorrow, and we know who holds our hand. I love that song. But I wanted to get on here and read you a devotional that really has, that touched me. So I wanted to share it with y'all, and it's entitled Breath of Life. And it comes from Psalms 147, verse 3. He healeth the broken heart and bindeth up their wounds. As a result of sin, every person on earth is born into a fallen world. The sinful condition brings hurt, heartache to all men. Those who serve the Lord and those who don't. The good news is, as a child of God, you have hope and eternal future in Christ. Jesus said, These things have I spoken unto you, that you might have peace. In the world ye shall have tribulation, be of good cheer, I have overcome the world, and that's John sixteen thirty three. When life brings disappointment, hurt, and pain that is almost unbearable, remember that you serve the one who heals hearts. He knows you best and loves you most. When the wind is knocked out of you and you feel there's no oxygen left in the room, let God provide you with the air that you need to breathe. Breathe out a prayer to him and breathe in his peace and comfort today. And as I thought about this, I thought about myself and I thought about so many other people that are going through things. It's not just me. There's many that are suffering, that are hurting, um, that are facing these storms that are coming in. So there's a lot of people, y'all, that are going through things. Uh, you and I are not the only ones. Uh, but we know God holds our hand and he holds tomorrow. And that's what I'm clinging to and holding on to. That he's here with me and he's getting me through. And if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't have got this far. And I know that without a shadow of a doubt. Here comes Tucker. He's probably going to walk right in front of me. <laughs> I love him. Even when I'm in so much pain, he can just bring a smile to my face. God knows what we need and who we need and when we need it. Know that I love you. I'm praying for you. But the Lord loves you so much more.